based on the same passage, one more question is given. Four statements are given in the same topic stereochemistry. We have to identify which one of these four topics is correct. We will go by statements, various statements one after the other. The first one is conformers. What are conformers? Conformers are rotational isomers. So, rotational isomers, the statement given is the conformational isomers can be easily separated and isolated at ordinary temperatures. When you have two different conformers, they can be easily identified. Just like the enantiomers, they can be easily identified. Is that correct statement? It is not a correct statement because the purpose is the purpose of the question is the statement of the question is which one is a correct statement. A is not a correct statement because conformers have two different conformers. Every one degree there can be a conformers. Conformers means they are rotational isomers. They are obtained by rotation. By rotating through a small degree, it can be different types of conformers can be obtained and they cannot be easily separated because under ordinary conditions, the energy difference between the conformers will be very small and the small energy difference makes it difficult for us to isolate and separate them individually. Therefore, it they cannot be separated. This is not a correct statement. Racemic compounds mean, what is the racemic compound? A racemic compound is a mixture of D and L. A D configuration is there, L configuration is there or D rotation is there. L rotation is there, it is a mixture of the two and therefore, the D rotation, the L rotation there are that is what is known as a resolution, that is what is known as a resolve. Separation of the racemic uh, mixture, the D and L mixture to give rise to individually what are D and L compound, the two are the same excepting one will have the D rotation or the plus rotation small d and small l racemic. So, racemic compounds can be resolved that is the right statement. And about the third statement, capital D and plus are the same, it is not correct. Capital D represents the configuration, whereas the plus or minus represents the sign of rotation. The sign of rotation and configuration D can be plus or D can be minus. So, D and plus need not be the same. So, that is also not a correct statement. And uh, when you look at these two structures, one is uh, the Fisher projection, the other is the wet projection, they are represented as enantiomers. There are only two possibilities, either they are the same or they are uh, two different representations, they are either they are enantiomers or two different representations of the same compound. It is given as enantiomers. When you look at it closely, as we have discussed a number of times earlier, convert this into the Newman, convert this into the Fisher projection, you will find the two are not enantiomers, there are two different representations of the same compound. So, this statement is also not correct. So, out of these uh, four statements, only one statement namely the racemic compounds which is a DL can be separated individually as small d and small l. It is not capital D, it is small d and small l or small d corresponds to plus and the small l corresponds to minus, it is a sign of rotation plus or minus. So, that is the only one statement which is correct all the other statements are not correct.